here's my how it would reboot the crow basically um sorry if this is i hope i hope people like this i don't know but it was it's actually been something i was i sort of every now and then i'll think of an idea i did it with friday the 13th and i think rugrats but this is my own kind of idea on how to do it so i think when you look at the franchise of the crow from the brandon lee one to whatever the fuck that most recent one is it's all a bunch of dudes and i know there is a lady crow i don't know the comics very well so if you're gonna get mad at me for um not being like the comics at all no this is sort of me going off the dome on the crow movies i've seen which is just the first two and the new one and some of the show when i was a little drunk but um basically the idea is um we've you know obviously we've had a ton of dude crows this would be a female crow but the difference is it'll be a little different but it'll use ideas from the original crow so um my idea is basically that you have uh basically sort of like a female version of the crow you know and she uh had a bunch of friends who are all kind of like very much community or organizer stuff is like all mostly girls and stuff and then um, she kind of realizes why they're doing it is for like nefarious reasons, like evil reasons, like gentrification, but evil stuff like through one of them, the main girl through a rich dad and they, you know, murder her, of course, in a horrific way because it's the crow. And then instead of coming back like right away or a year later, this happens in the end of the 90s. Um, and so then she comes back now. And all of the girls who killed her are grown up. I kind of just want it to be flashbacks like the original Crow, but I'm just setting it up for sake because I like the idea of it just being like a straight revenge thing. And so all the henchmen, I guess, are evil people who are basically gentrifying this area, which is, by the way, like in the original Crow, the reason Shelly and Eric Draven were killed was because they were fighting against the people who were selling drugs. So the idea of the Crow stopping a neighborhood changing is actually like in the first movie so um so i'm sort of like bouncing off that idea so the they're basically they've gentrified this whole area they're down to like this one spot which had a, represented a lot to their friend who um who they killed um and so all these girls who have now grown up and gentrified the area will all be played by various kind of people big female actresses sort of from the 90s so the main kind of evil person would, I, I was thinking like kind of a Sarah Michelle Gellar kind of part because we don't see her as much and I think she'd be a cool villain and then like you can have like Julia Stiles as her second in command you can have um, I actually thinking Nia Long because she was I believe she was in Bring It On and then have you know a, a assortment of people who are teens and 90s movies kind of leading the being the bad guys like you have Freddie Prince Jr or Matthew Lillard, or like that kind of that Rachel Lee Cook, like all those like main people. So, because I realized when I watched the Brandon Lee Crow, is that you, it's not just that Brandon Lee was good, it's that he had a crazy supporting cast. So the supporting cast would be like this cool amalgamation of people from the 90s. And so she's come back, but it'll be kind of like, she'll come back and be like listening to goth stuff, but take it very seriously. So it'll be like kind of funny, but kind of not, she'll play very seriously i think i was thinking like um like mia goth or someone like that um because she's young enough and spooky enough so it'd be like this revenge thing and i think like the first death would actually be sarah michelle geller's dad who's funding all this stuff and you could get like a cool cameo type of person uh i don't have an idea for that one but basically would be the idea of a female crow like fighting the gentrification of their area um, and killing off various 90s actresses and actors from teen movies um, while um, she gets her revenge kind of uh, or vengeance for her own death and what they've done to the area that she loved so much so that was my I don't know that's kind of the idea I kept thinking about and I thought it'd be a cool crow movie I don't have like you know more than that but it was like in my head and this way I got it out and I hope I don't think it'll ever get made <laughs> But it's cool to use that idea for something. Maybe this was just a silly idea. Anyway.